Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Hell's Hill, the only colony on the edge of the frontier, owned and operated by corporations. A trip of ten short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny. When you go out of this world to the Halcyon Cove, Ay, boniqueto. El 
A gunslinger. Oh, they're going to tell stories about you from here to Hephaestus. Someone with a talent for exploiting insecurities. A crack shot, capital. Yes, I should pick someone likely to survive a hail of gunfire. Safety inspector. Oh, they must have meant bribe collector. A physician? Not many of you left. Oh, I'm going to have some. Oh, it's my worst. I'm going to have some. Bueno, esta pena. Bueno, este. ¿Para qué tanto rollo así? Más parecido mío es este. Después de un juicio amplio, el diálogo volverá. 
Morast. Ya que le macho a mí. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Please power down your engines. Have prepared to be not likely bootlickers. <laughs> Initiate ship jump. There you are, wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on out have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. 
Is something wrong? Oh, yes. Uh, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Mm. Now, my mm. ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! Or a chauffeur, so to speak. Not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one of a kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm... all the colonists are counting on you. Hawthorne oh, should be close by. What in law's name? Is that him? Oh, that idiot. I told him to plant the beacon and move away, not stand there holding it. Yeah. Oh well, no sense in letting his ship go to waste. Hawthorne won't mind you taking his ship. Better you than the board, huh? Not sure I trusted the fellow. Might have gone after the bounty on my head. Shame about the whole washing thing. Nasty way to go. Ya, vamos pasando más rápido así. Coño, no me veo, no me veo los pies. Vaya, Parece que me veo una parte de panorámica. Una cámara panorámica. Oh, 
is the one of the much open. Hey, you, come here. You've tried the best now. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stinks. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Better, thanks to you. I might have bled out on my own. Or worse, had to go begging the boss for some Madrina time. We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take him. Then my gun misfired. Right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Gibbering, flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics. With guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them. Yeah, okay. You look like you know your way around a gun. Got some spare ammo. Not counting the bullet in my side. Here, you can have my saber too, for patching me up and all. All Spacer's Choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's Choice. Yes, nailed it that time. You hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. Uh, prettiest place in the Vale. Uh, be sure to... Sp the don't take this the wrong way or...
No, to no. normal de un paso de estar así I don't know where you came from, stranger, but you best keep your head. Go! Really? How is he? Shouldn't have done that. Space's Choice family ain't authorized to receive medical aid from all brand physicians. We'll see him back to Edgewater. Just as soon as I cross these marauders off, I just, you know. Well, sometimes. Management's real good at cost-benefit analysis. But, seeing as I'm... You know what? You're right. Here we go. Oh. 
que no tiene que decir algo en el futuro. Please be informed that this vessel contains no valuable plunder. Marauder, please be informed that ignoring me is dangerous for your health. Back away from the navigation... Hello, Marauder. I am Aiden, the autonomous digital astrogator of this vessel. Please be informed that I am authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. Please return any misappropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. Deception protocols have failed. I have been programmed to express disappointment. I am incapable of accepting orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. I understand. I will require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. I am programmed to take orders exclusively from Captain Hawthorne. If I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? Bueno, y al quinto, ¿eh? Para hacer Well done, Captain Hawthorne. I see your powers of deductive reasoning remain intact. 
Unfortunately, our engine is currently inoperable. Our main drive suffered a critical power failure, and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably damaged and must be replaced. Astutely observed. However, the probability of locating a power regulator within a worker settlement falls within acceptable parameters of certainty. High capacity power regulators are sometimes employed in the electrical networks of worker settlements. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's identity cartridge. Please try not to lose it this time. This cartridge identifies you, Alex Hawthorne, as the registered proprietor and captain of the Unreliable. Do you understand? Thank you. I appreciate your cooperation. Best of luck in your search for a power regulator. Try to stay alive this time. What can I do for you, Captain? Goodbye. ここ
el trozo de este lado de la idea, se acaba el trozo, como si no puede ser aquí. Se ha comprado con tres puntos de ventaja, como se ha dado de ver, todo así. O sea que... Se va a meter en un mar. A ver, pero está haciendo... ¿Cuándo hizo para la puta madre? Ah, joder. Y ahora... La navigación console es offline at this time, Captain. Se va a deshacer un los ojos, se evita de...
If your equipment is in need of repair or modification, the Crux 2000 workbench is at your disposal, Captain. The ship's engines cannot be powered until a replacement regulator has been properly installed. If you possess a power regulator, please insert the part into the appropriate slot, which is this one. These surveillance devices allow me to monitor you constantly. Please ignore them. Due to catastrophic power failure, all doors will remain on security lockdown. en el coche. Say, this wouldn't happen to be your ship, would it? Because you sure walked in it like it was your ship. And if this ship is yours... Oh, by the law. I'm so sorry. I had no idea we had an inspector coming. If you'd like to speak with my manager, I report to Constable Reyes in Edgewater. Edgewater's not too far. Just follow the road east of here, over past the cemetery. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to inspect the crime scene before I make my report. This is gonna take a lot of paperwork. Un volcán. 